Hey everyone, it's me, so today I'm going to be doing my back to school haul, and this is most of the stuff that I bought for school. I mean, I might be purchasing a couple different other things that I haven't gotten around to getting, so this is just what I have purchased so far. So, okay, the first thing that I got was this pencil pouch, and I got this for 99 cents, and I got this at the 99 cent store because they don't really, you don't really need to get a, like a beautiful pencil pouch for school, and it's just like clear. Like the that. next thing I got was this compass and this protractor and I just got this because I needed the protractor in it and it was once again 99 So you guys may know I have a little bit of an obsession with Snooki. I got this Snooki book and it's called Gorilla Beach. So I also love using bobby pins so I decided to just pick up a pack of these. There's like a hundred bobby pins right here. And then I just picked up three packs of 200 index cards in it each so I just picked them up for 99 cents also each. And then I just picked up these staples because I always run out of staples. No matter where I go, I always need staples. So I figured I would pick these up. So then next I just got the, I like having firm, not soft. I'm not really a soft type of toothbrush person. So I just picked up um, two Colgate um, Extra Clean and they're both in firm and one's purple and one's red. And um, I picked these up because I need a new toothbrush because the school year is starting and I always pick up new like essentials and all that and um, it just seemed a lot easier to do that. So then the next thing is just baking soda whitening with tartar protection and this is just a Crest fluoride like toothpaste planner for 2013 and 2014 because you, I know personally I always need a, one of these because I need to stay organized but I don't always use the actual planner. But um, I figured high school I need to try getting into better like organizational because I usually just write myself a list but I need to start writing it down in here. And then I just picked up a bunch of composition books and I have two black composition books, two purple and then two pink so I just picked up these and they're just really pretty colors and I like the way they bend and they're nice. So the next I just picked up three purple spiral round notebooks only because purple is a really pretty color and um... I might need these, I might not, who knows, and it's better to be prepared because they were only like 17 cents, which is a really good price. But um, I just got these three folders that are also purple because I'm just kind of going into like the pink and purple theme. And I also picked up six of these five tab things because even though, as you guys can tell, I'm a little bit of a junkie for school supplies, but I figured I could put these in my binders and they're not that expensive they're like 88 cents which was less than a dollar. So then I went and I looked at the binders and I was like you know I need an expensive binder so I just got a bunch of these um, one inch binders because I don't I want one for like every two classes and um, I have six classes and I have six binders but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch them through halfway through the year because I don't need to, I, my binders will break anyway because I put too much in them. But I got two purple, two black, and a blue and a gray. Five packs of this graphing um, paper. I just picked up, I love college ruled, so I obviously I don't go for wide ruled anymore. But I picked up this college ruled, and I have ten of these um, filler papers, and I have more. So um, I picked up those. I picked up these ones also. Then I just picked up some phone in products that I could easily have in my backpack that people wouldn't see as easily so. traveling toothbrush and toothpaste I picked this up at Target so you guys may or may not know this but I'm a huge like school supplies junkie so if you guys can tell I kind of got like I'm going into ninth grade and I don't really need all that stuff but I picked up so much more because I'm I saw stuff from last year and you know I just can't help myself I just picked up a pack of eight mechanical pencils right here because these ones look like they might be good, and if they're not, then oh well, they were only a dollar. Then I picked up for like almost three dollars, I picked up a pack of 20 pencils, another pack of 20 pencils, another pack of 20 pencils, and another pack of 20 pencils. So now I have 88 mechanical pencils that I just bought. But then I just picked up these three attractable erasers. I like these a lot because I can easily use it and it won't like it's a good eraser because it looks like a pencil and it's just like the top of the other erasers but they last so much longer since they're so long and they didn't cost that much so they were really good. And then I also picked up this mini printed stapler because I'm trying to go with like the more girly theme for this type of school supplies 
and it's just really cute and it comes with like a lot of staples also and um it just looks like that so if you guys don't know this already besides my pencil obsession i have a pen obsession also but it's like i have a lot more pens but i go through them just like pencils pretty fast I just picked up this pack and this is just the ink joy and these are pretty they didn't cost that much but they're by paper mate. other people's but these would be really good for doing notes and everything so i figured i would just check these out and if i like them i can always pick up more I had to pick up two red pen correcting papers. They don't want you to use the same color, so they give you red. And I just picked up these G2, and these are just these pens. And then my holy grail of all pens. Like, I love these pens so much because of the fact that they're just such good quality. But I love this one, and this is, I love them both, and I got really lucky because they didn't have any more red ones, and they didn't have any more besides this one pack of, like, they're a little bent because they're at the very bottom. And um, these are the blue. And this is in blue ink and this is in black ink. And I just love these so much that I just, you know, I had to. It's a really good investment because these ones roll and they're, these ones glide so nicely and you can write easily and they are just so smooth when you write with them. And then as you guys can tell, I didn't have enough so I just picked up this pack of highlighters. So then I went and I picked up some cotton balls. Picked up more nail polish remover because I needed this, babe. Picked up this herbal essences i just love this i don't even know how to explain it so you guys i'm gonna be working on a new video but i'm deciding before i work on the video um i picked this up because i want to make sure that it's good enough to talk about mm. target i also picked up this backpack because i wanted to find because i usually always get vera bradley but vera bradley has sadly gone out of style now they are still thriving with the like, younger grades but like in high school no one ta no one wears a Vera Bradley. It was really hard for me because I'm so used to buying Vera Bradley's because I'm not that girly girl but they look good and they work with anything that I wear. So I just picked up this and this was $22 I think. So then I just picked up this um, lunchbox and this only the only reason I got a lunchbox was because I need to get one more and um, I have to get one for each household so I figured I'd pick this one up and then um, it's just really tiny and cute and no one really cares what your lunchbox looks like So I just figured I'd pick this one up because it's cute and colorful And so the next place that I went to was Goodwill and I only went there because it was a Thursday And I figured you know what Sydney you are going to be a good shopper And you are gonna only spend a dollar on each piece of clothing or item that you get So they had Thursday's dollar day at my local Goodwill and they chose the tag which was green each Goodwill is always different, like they might have the same color tag, they might have different. So, I saved a good amount of money because um, I picked things with that tag and all that. So the first thing I got was this, and this was originally $6 at Goodwill, and it's just by the brand Dr Cambridge or something. And um, it's really cute because it's just this three-quarter length sleeve cardigan. This is really nice cardigan, I don't know if you guys can tell since the background is so, like, dark. But, um... I just love it because it has like the buttons and it's kind of like high in the front and or it's low in the front and high in the back which I really like that style. what season it is um and then you always have to find that slouchy sweater that actually looks good even though it's an ugly pattern so um I found this for a dollar also and I was originally also six dollars and it just looks like this and it's super it doesn't go with this outfit today but um It doesn't go with this outfit today, but if it, if I was wearing like a skirt and like a tank top, I mean I guess it would go with this if I was wearing a skirt. But um, I really like it because it's like so slouchy and cute and I can hang it off my shoulders and just like I can like make it look messy and I can just be like, you know, what up. I don't know how to explain it. I'm probably going to have this in a video soon, but um, not soon. I'll probably have this in one of my winter videos because... This is really warm and comfy and cute. As you guys know, I go to Goodwill for the reason to go and get stuff for a dollar, but I always go to the jeans section first and I find a bunch of jeans that I like, that are my size, but I found these which are Eva Low Rise um, Super Flare Grain by the brand Grain, and these ones are so cute. Let me tell you, they are adorable. So, um,. First, the pockets have just like little gems, and it's like really simple, but it's really cute, and there's no rips. 
And these ones are also $6.99, but these ones are not. These are capris. And I really like them because they're definitely really unique. But the back has only one pocket And I was just looking in the area because I knew that I needed to find... Because I knew that I needed to find some stuff to hold my makeup brushes but I found these and these are you can find them at any Goodwill really because so many people donate this kind of stuff but if you guys are looking for stuff that you don't want to spend a lot of money but you still want to get a good deal and you want it to be good quality the next thing that I got I haven't priced out online yet because they were just such I'm just so happy but I got these super duper they're completely clean like whoever had these never wore them like see yeah. the actual like print that they had on it before you know when they first bought it but I love them because they're so classic I can wear them they so you guys that was all from my haul I hope that you guys enjoyed and if you guys did please thumbs up this video if you guys want any types of back to school videos let me know in the comments down below so um that's what I got I know it seemed like a lot when I bought it but it went by pretty fast in this video so I hope this video was not too long because I love talking and also, you guys, if you guys are interested in still getting an interview for Beauty Guru Interview, um, I'm just mentioning this really to get your channel promoted because so many people always ask me to go subscribe to their channel. So I'm like, you know what, I'm going to tell you guys about this because some of you guys might not have wanted to watch the other one I made, the impromptu. But if you guys want to do that, you guys can. And also, if you guys want to go subscribe to one of the girls on YouTube that I know and I think she's really nice. Her name is Simply Amber 101 and I'll have her link down below and I'll have um, Beauty Guru interview down below because you know I was the first interview and I was the first person they emailed and we've been working together for a while now trying to figure out like how to get their channel started and everything. Subscribe if you haven't already because you know it's free. So I love you guys so much. Bye.